Hello friends. Today I am back with one more app in which we will learn how to use radio button. So the question is what is radio button? If you want to choose only one option at a time then you have to use radio button. So I made this app for you. In this I put a label here. In this I had written information about continents and oceans. Then select option. If I select this continent and click enter. So you will come on corresponding page. Then if you click here then you will come on home page. So let's start to make this app. So come on code.org, enter your username and password, then go on create and click on app lab. So first we have to design our app. Is screen 1. On the screen 1, we need to go on design and select the theme. So I am selecting the theme here. Then I need a label on this. I am going to write. information about information about continent and oceans okay. and make the font size bigger this is 20 and make the size a little bit bigger you can design according to your choice. You can choose color combination or theme according to your choice. Now, take one more label on which I am going to write. Select one option. Select option. And the size should be 15. Then I need two radio button. 1 and 2. Need to set the properties of radio button. I am changing the group ID of radio button in R1 and radio button 2 is R1 and this is R2. I need two label. One is for continent and one is for Ocean. So, I'm writing here continent. And this is ocean. And I need a button here on which I'm writing enter. Okay. So, oh. By mistake, I've written here, so I'm need. I need to set the ID again. Button one, and here I'm writing enter. And make the size of this little bit bigger. This ID button. Okay. So our this screen part is done. Now we'll come on screen 2 so I need to add a new screen if user will select continent then this screen will show so I am writing here continents and heading font size 20 and I need a label here in which I will paste information about continent which I am going to search on Google continents so select its definition or oh, what exactly continents are click here and I'm selecting this copy and paste it here in the text column paste Make the font size a little bit bigger. 15. It's fine. And I need an image button so that I can paste image of continent here. So for 
uploading the image click on here image choose so that you can choose image from your device or direct from google okay so i choose this now come on screen 3 if user will select oceans then this screen will open which is screen 3 new screen i need a label here on which i am going to write oceans the font size big and i need a label in which i can paste information about oceans so i'm going to write here oceans and this is all about oceans so i'm going to paste it here and make the font size bigger similarly i need a button image button so that i can put image of oceans as i have already saved this image on my laptop so i'm choosing it from here so this is our designing part is done now come on coding part so we need to do coding on button click event okay so on event button click this is button okay if user will select this continent then what will going to happen else if user will select this then what will going to happen that means we need to use control which control we are going to use if else okay now come on ui controls if get checked if user is that check if user will click on radio button 1 user id uh, id of radio button 1 is r1 then what will going to happen set screen set screen 1 then we can click here and then if get checked radio button 2 is get checked here get checked radio button 2 which is r2 then what will going to happen set a screen oh, oh i need to write here the screen 2 Yeah, so as if user will select radio button 2 then what will going to happen set screen screen 3 screen 3 and I don't want this else block so just click and then run it and check whether our code is working or not so click on run I select this and enter this no that means it is showing some error that means the id is not valid i did some mistake here so reset it and check the id of the radio button so radio okay this radio button's id is radio underscore button one and this one is radio underscore button two so let me change it r1 see guy friends i did the mistake here i changed the name in group id which was wrong Okay, so set the ID again. This is R2. Okay, now come on coding. And I reset it again. Run it again. Now check. Now this is working. But I am unable to come on home page because I didn't did any coding for this page. So, we will do coding for this page. That means if on event 
on event screen 2 click if we will click on screen 2 then set screen to screen 1 and on event screen 3 if user will select on screen 3 then also user can come on screen 1 that means the home page so this is our coding is done let's check how it is working suppose i am clicking this option click on enter i will come on this page and on this page all information about ocean here now i am clicking anywhere on this screen i will come on home page so rename this project like radio button And save it so that if you want to see this project again from your project list you can easily find this and share it with your friends and family through uh, Twitter Facebook or you can check it also like this how your app will look like open a new tab paste this link here enter and see so you are able to create this app. I hope you understand all coding about the radio button. We'll see you in next project. If you like my video, please thumbs up, subscribe my channel and keep coding. Bye-bye.